I was just very shocked, surprised, and confused why that would be there. A college student upset after seeing a replica plane with a swastika at the Torrey Pines Glider Port. ABC 10 News reporter John Horn explains why it hit her so especially hard. It's a great view. It's fun to see the people parasailing and gliding. Shauna Ben Moshe says the Torrey Pines Glider Port is one of her favorite places in San Diego. But on a visit last month, she saw something that ruined the trip. And I didn't really know what to do because I was so shocked that I saw that in a place that I go to all the time. She's talking about this remote controlled plane with a Nazi swastika painted on the rudder. My great grandma's a, hol um, a Holocaust survivor. She was in Auschwitz for a long time and she lost all her family. Ben Moshe took this picture of the plane just before she left. She shared it with Brian Blatcher, who co-runs a group called Shield of David, which fights anti-Semitism. Blatcher went back to the glider port to investigate. That plane wasn't there, but a different pilot explained that it's common for people to fly German replica warplanes. It's hurtful. We've got a big Jewish community. We have Holocaust survivors living there. He's like, it's a, it's a plane. What are you so upset about kind of deal? It's unclear who flew the remote controlled plane, and there wasn't anyone flying those kinds of planes when our cameras stopped by Wednesday. Ben Moshe, now back in college in Wisconsin, says the glider port is in her thoughts. It's a place that I love, and, you know, I don't want anything to take away from that. In other words, she won't let this image keep her from going back. John Horn, ABC 10 News.